All right, guys. So today we will be installing an SSL certificate in our website or our websites using Sortbot. So let's get started. Now, first of all, we need uh, uh, we need to install Python Sortbot. So for that, first we need to add a repository. So you go sudo add apt repository, and if you are in uh, CentOS or other Red Hat systems do something equivalent. I don't exactly remember what it is, but you know, do it anyway. <laughs> okay. So this is sortbot slash sortbot. Now hit enter. What's my password? Hmm. Okay. So this should be okay so this pp has been deprecated nonetheless we will install it because you gotta do what you gotta do and this is very easy all right so once it done it's done we just go sudo apt install python search bot apache all right hit enter and this is installing all right now it's done. It's literally done. Now you just set up SSL. So for that, the command is sortbot Apache. And then you give your website name, like example.com. And again, you go example2.com. So you do it for how many other websites you have in your VPS. But since I don't have this example2 and example.com, what I'm going to do is if you have multiple, if you have tens of websites and you want to install for all of them, you can just hit enter like this. Now we have an error here. So what can we do? Let's add sudo here. Okay. So here you can see there are a list of 24 websites that I have options to install SSL in. Now what you want to do is uh, you just, you know, you just write like in which websites do you want to install SSL? You just write the corresponding numbers. So like one comma two comma three comma twenty comma twenty one. So and if you hit enter, it will install SSL in all of these things. But I don't want to do this right now. So what I want to do is I just enter one, and now it is obtaining a certificate. Also, if you are in Nginx and not Apache, uh, just check out the description below. I have some other repositories and things that you have to install for Nginx too. All right. All right. Now what you want to do is you have the options of, uh, you know, setting the redirect or not setting the redirect. So if you set a redirect, that means if someone goes to HTTP, HTTP call on your site, they will be ready redirected to HTTPS. And if you do no redirect, then they will not be redirect, redirected. So I'll just hit two here. And as you can see, the enhancement was already set. So it didn't do any enhancements. Now we are done. So now we can go to our website and it should be in SSL. All right. And redirected because we had done, we had chosen two. So go, go and check it out.